Are you currently having problems with your Tesla app not working and you want to be able to fix this? Well, then this video is going to be perfect for you because in this video, I'm going to show you step by step exactly how to fix this. So what you're going to do firstly is to actually close your Tesla app and instead you're going to open up your settings app. So go into your settings app and as you can see, we should now be taken to this page right here, which is perfect. So on this page, just scroll down a little bit until you can see where it says general. So click on general in here. And as you can see, it should now take us to this page, which is perfect. So on this page, just scroll down until you can see where it says storage. So click on storage in here. And it's going to take probably a couple of seconds for this page to completely load, just so you know. But in here, we're just going to scroll down and then you're going to click on Tesla in here, as you can see. So open up your Tesla app. Now, actually, I had this problem myself before. So what I did to be able to fix it, at least for me, I clicked on offload app in here. And then once again, I clicked on offload app. Then I had to wait a couple of seconds. I clicked on the blue button here once again. And basically, as you can see, it says loading here for me. And what will happen now is that it will actually automatically update to the newest version for my Tesla app. So actually this was able to fix it for me. I was able to access the app after that. So I guess that when there is like a new update on the app itself, we have to actually get it because sometimes if we don't, it's going to be bugs and stuff like that. So try it out and I hope that this will be able to fix it for you as well.